More than 10 years have passed since the National Dismantlement War. A league of corporations has taken control of the world. To escape the pollution that poisons the surface of the planet, they have built massive floating platforms called cradles. Only there, 7,000 meters above the ground, is the air clean and safe. Already half of mankind lives in the skies. The planet's surface has become a battlefield where armies fight to control the resource plants that feed the cradles. As the war came to a close, giant humanoid weapons called Armored Core Nexts enabled the League to firmly establish their rule of the planet. Their pilots are called Lynx. Fearing the power and independence of these Nexts, the League left them behind on the surface. The Lynx now work as mercenaries for an organization called Collard. While the League armies derive their power from massive arms forts, the once mighty Nexts are consigned to the poisoned earth, serving as foot soldiers in the never-ending economic war. This is your mission. Eradicate the defensive units deployed in the Line Arc Zone. As you know, Line Arc is the main base of the anti-establishment forces that oppose the Cradles. We have tried to negotiate peacefully with these revolutionaries, but they have refused our overtures and continue their violent attacks. This mission is a show of force to encourage the enemy to rejoin negotiations. We never like to resort to violence, but on this occasion, we have no choice. Linox's main weapon, White Glint, is currently operating in another area. It will not become a risk in this operation. Note that this mission is a test run of your capabilities. We trust that you will deliver a successful result. Commence mission. Destroy all line arc defense units. Elite next! Damn it, not now! Here's your mission. The client is GA America. The objective is the Interior Union Force based at the Mimir Naval Port. You'll be supplied with a generous amount of ordnance. Don't let up on the attack until ordered to withdraw. The more damage and destruction you cause, the better your pay will be. This information is unconfirmed, but we believe a new model arms fort is in dock for maintenance and supply. If it's there, don't let it get away. The client is offering a special bonus for its elimination. Well, that's about it. This is a good deal for the right links. We'll be waiting to hear from you. Commence mission. Destroy all enemies inside the combat zone. Time is limited. Move quickly.
This area looks clear. Head elsewhere. Time is of the essence. remaining. Arms fort confirmed. That's our bonus target. Prioritize it. This is your mission. This request is coming from the Bernard and Felix Foundation. They want you to take out the enemy forces assaulting Omer's sphere. Some big shot of the BFF has drawn up the mission plan this time. So, you better listen up. Right now, the enemy forces are moving through White End towards the sphere. Blast through their rear column using the VOB and take out as many units as possible along the way. Once you've penetrated the front line, turn around and engage the survivors. So the plan says. It's not a bad plan. You shouldn't have any problems. We'll look forward to hearing from you.
targets destroyed. Mission complete. This is the mission. The client is GA America. The target is the algebra forces guarding the Richland Agricultural Plant. Your task is extremely simple. We want you to destroy all enemy units. There's one catch. The enemy has commandeered a GA manufactured arms fort. The client could not give us many details, but it sounds like it's gonna give you some trouble. Oh yeah. Like before, we can provide you with support next for this mission. Let me know if you want to draw on these resources. Anyway, that's all. It's a dangerous job, but the pay makes it worth your while. Let us know if you're in. Mission. Arms Fort Landcrafts confirmed. Intel was right on the money this time. They're standard models, but don't underestimate them. Proceed with caution. Don't waste ammunition on its front. Circle around it while avoiding the main cannon's firing radius. Landcraft destroyed. Good. Now just mop up the small fry. Let's clean up and go home. Mission complete. This is your mission. Your target is the Arms Fort Gigabase, currently escorted by the BFF 8th Fleet. The convoy is sailing south through the Northwest Sea. The 8th Fleet is a powerful force made up of large cruisers and other smaller vessels. However, the fleet itself is not your target. Don't waste ordnance on it. Use a Vanguard Overt Boost Unit to accelerate past the escorts directly to the Gigabase. Get in close and destroy the target as quickly as possible. In addition, the Union will pay you a bonus for the destruction of the supply vessels. You can ignore the other secondary targets if you wish. That's all. The Union speaks very highly of you. We hope you can take this on. Destroy the Arms Fort Gigabase. It's being escorted by the 8th Fleet. Use the VOB to close in on Gigabase. Watch out for long-range fire. This Arms Fort is a defensive stronghold. Don't underestimate its firepower. Sink Gigabase as quickly as possible. 
to stop wasting time. Confirmed. Gigabase has been destroyed. Mission complete. Here's the outline of your mission. Your objective will be to support the Union transports as they move into the Red Valley. Red Valley is a former transit hub, crisscrossed with multiple transport routes. It is currently under the control of GA America. The plan is for you to rapidly neutralize the GA garrison and secure the shortest possible route through the valley. Once the coast is clear, you will proceed to escort the transportation units to the far side. The Union is offering a sliding scale bonus, depending on how many transports survive. That's everything you need to know. You're known within the Union as a highly capable Lynx. We hope that you can take this on. Commence mission. Try to whittle down the enemy forces as much as possible before the transports arrive. ahead. They appear to be large, old-type units. More than enough to stop the transport's cold. You must remove all obstacles.
confirmed. Transport units have exited the combat zone. Mission complete. Well done. Damage to the transports was insignificant. This is your mission. Your target is the GA America Next Wonderful Body. It is a rank 24 two-legged model of medium size. Our transport units will serve as bait to draw the target to Old Peace City. As soon as you confirm its location, take it out. The Union has authorized the use of support nests for this operation. We've recruited a selection for you to choose from. Use them as you see fit. That's the briefing. The Interior Union holds you in high regard. We hope you take on this mission. Commence mission. Eliminate the target next wonderful body. This is Windy Fanchon and Ryder Palash here. Wonderful body's position confirmed. Commencing attack. Finally, they've thrown a next at me. The Interior Union dragged their feet too much. Wonderful body has been destroyed. Looks like mission accomplished. You call that a lynx? It looks like he was malfunctioning. Attack Transport Arms Fort, Cobracon. Cobracon is protected by a very thick sheet of armor and is impossible to take down with standard next weaponry. I don't mind telling you that it's a real headache to deal with. However, the thing does have a weak point. If you can manage to get under the skirting armor at its base, you'll be able to take out the tracks and bring it to a halt. That's all we need you to do for this operation. Frankly, the top brass don't have all the details themselves. What they do know is that this arms fort could become a serious threat. Anyone taking this job will be well compensated. We hope to hear from you soon. Commence mission. 
destroy the arms for at Cabracon. Powerful mines are scattered all over the combat zone. Stay alert now. The League has focused on maintaining complete and utter control. They agreed this goal could never be entrusted to any single person who, if eliminated, could jeopardize their reign. So in the aftermath of the Lynx War, the League manufactured enormous battle stations called arms forts. Manned by a crew of thousands of expendable soldiers, this was military might the League could control and therefore trust. Arms forts have become the perfect solution to the League's needs, and their firepower far and away surpasses the average next. Dream and hope as they might, the next pilots know that those who dare take on giants rarely live to tell the tale. Here's the mission. The client is GA America, 
Your target is the Interior Union's land-based arms sport unit. The enemy is currently pursuing a GA America transport unit through the Loro Desert. Your task is to neutralize them before they can take out GA's forces. The Interior Union arms forts are armed with multiple strafing lasers. Once our transports come in range of those weapons, they'll be dead in the sand. Keep that in mind. Basically, we just need you to take it out fast. Nothing fancy. That's it. This is a good job for the right links. Contact us. Commence mission. Destroy all enemy arms fort units. Virtual defense line is displayed on your radar. Enemy units crossing that line will have a firing solution on the transports. That equals mission failure for us. We don't want that to happen, do we? Hold the line. Another arm sport down. One more. Successful. The transports are safe. Good work. Here's the mission. The client is GA America. Your target is the PAN-51 New Resource Plant. This mission is simple. Take out the defenses and destroy the plant. There is one catch, however. You must complete the mission within the specified time frame. I suppose the big shots have their reasons for choosing the links of your caliber. There will be bonuses for completing the mission in as short a time as possible. This is a chance for you to make some extra cash. And that's about it. You could do worse, right? Let us know if you want the job. Commence mission. Take out the enemy defenses and destroy the resource plants. The clock's ticking. No time to waste. Aha! It's Marat Squatter. No wonder the defense units were targeted. Cunning rats. Resource plant destroyed. Two more to go.
resource plants remain. Get on it. Confirmed. All targets destroyed. Mission complete. Interior Union's new maritime arms fort, Stigro. Stigros are equipped with large-scale blades at their front. Therefore, launching a frontal assault on one of them would be tantamount to suicide. Avoid doing so. That's all. It's a dangerous mission, but one with a big payday. Let us know. Commence mission. Destroy the arms fort Stigro. His charging attack isn't too complex, but it'll rip you in two if you get hit. So don't. for attack. Megalus is a power recycling plant and a key element in the Line Arc lifeline. We are working as fast as we can to establish adequate defenses, but the Omer forces are drawing too close too fast. The defenses will not be completed in time. This situation has left us no choice. We need you to defend Megalus. The Omer forces will consist mostly of aerial attack units. Do you think you can drive them off and protect the lives of millions of innocent citizens? Of course, we will compensate you as best we can. Thank you in advance for your help. Commence mission. Protect Megalus and eliminate all enemy units. The enemy's main force is Omer's aerial brigade. They'll make trouble if you give them the opportunity. This is the Megalus base commander. We're counting on you. Don't let us down. Reinforcements inbound. An aerial arms board. An eclipse? Omer must be in business. Watch for the main laser cannon. It may be a factory model, but it still packs a punch.
reached. Thanks to your efforts, we owe you a serious debt. Let's review your mission. The client is Algebra Corporation. Your objective is to eradicate the next occupying the Richland Agricultural Plant. We don't have too many details on the target. We know it's not affiliated with the Collard, but it appears to be a two-legged heavy. A tough nut to crack. Of course, the client expects you to cooperate with other links for this operation. Overall battlefield strategy is up to you. But please, don't try to be a hero. You have allies. Use them. Briefing complete. This is an excellent opportunity to strengthen your relationship with the Algebra Corporation. It might open some doors, too. mission. Destroy the unidentified next. Fellow Lynx, even for I alone, this operation presents a low risk of failure. You are welcome to turn back at any time. Operation underway. Whose peon is it this time? Perfect timing. I was getting tired of arms forts. Unidentified next destroyed. Is this it? What a boring operation. Mission complete. It looks like you're improving out there. is what we want you to do. The League is launching an all-out offensive against Line Arc. They have been trying to break us through indirect, surreptitious means for some time, but we have stood firm. Now they're dropping the pretense and showing their true colors. 
The ace up our sleeve is White Glint. But if the League comes at us with everything they've got, even that won't be enough. That's why we need you to be our trump card. The corporations abandoned the planet's surface and the people who live there. They are no longer part of a rational economic system that supports society. They have become no more than elitist parasites. You know the truth. A world ruled by the League is doomed. We, the people, must control our own lives and build our own future. Of course, we will pay you as much as we can. Please, help us in this fight for freedom. Those slimy politicians with all their empty calls to arms in the name of liberty. I'll sink the whole lot of you to the bottom of the ocean. You ready, Fragile? Preparations complete. Hmm, good to hear. Move out. Commence mission. Cooperate with White Glint and eliminate the League Nexts. We've detected two enemy Nexts, Stasis and Fragile. Stasis? It's on Starva, the Rank 1 Lynx. The League isn't holding back. White Glint Operator Fiona Jarnfeld here. I appreciate the assistance. Good luck to both of us. What? The boosters have cut out. Damn it, I'm sinking. I can't go down like this. White Glint is disabled. He cannot come to your help any longer. I'm sorry. It appears you have left me no choice. Initiating Plan D. Now it is one against one. Test applicability increased. Excellent. from the AMS. Ah! Confirmed. Fragile has been destroyed. Mission complete. In the end, only you remain. I can't believe it. Just a brief moment of relief. Let's make the most of it. Fellow Lynx, allow me to express our gratitude. Thank you. However, this might mean the end of Line Arc. Line Arc's White Glint was defeated, and Kalard's top ranked Lynx, Atstarva, went down into the ocean. After the intense battle between the Cradle's greatest Lynx, only one remained. Linark had lost its greatest military asset. The Cradles entered a period of stability, or so everyone believed. Behind the scenes, the League prepared for a new, more violent phase of the war. At that moment, despite the period of calm, the gears of a sinister plan had begun to turn. White Glint and Fragile have been heavily damaged. Stasis sank into the sea, and Atstarva is missing. According to our intelligence, the only confirmed survivor is White Glint's partner. They are too cocky for their own good. Especially our boy genius, Atstarva. Maybe. Maybe not. Something about this whole thing stinks. In any case, White Glint has fallen, and I sincerely doubt the survivor is going to be Lionheart's successor. We have achieved our basic objectives. Yes, but we paid the price. <laughs> so you think you can take their place? 
What about Gerald? What do you mean? Nothing. It's just that old fogies aren't as much used to us now, are they? Are you looking for a fight? Enough. If you've got something to prove, do it on the battlefield. No one's stopping you there. Besides, there is still a lot we have to discuss. For example, this Ontario assault. What are we to do with the survivors? Commence mission. The target is a good distance above your position. Start climbing. You know what you're doing, what it will mean, don't you? Targets destroyed. Mission complete. Mission briefing begin. Your target is the BFF 8th Fleet, currently deployed in the Northwest Sea. The Union has committed the Arms Fort Stigro to this mission. You will rendezvous with the Stigro and destroy all targets. The 8th Fleet has been picked apart by repeated battles. If we strike now, you and the Stigro should be able to wipe out the remnants. That's the mission. The Union has been impressed with your performance thus far. We hope you can take this on. Commence mission. Destroy the BFF 8th Fleet. For this operation, you're paid in proportion to the number of mission targets you eliminate. Stigro's on your side, but it's also your competition. Show them that you're better than some simple piece of hardware.
on a nice payday. Here's your mission. You are to target the three Kojima energy plants located on the lowest level of the B7 deep mining facility. B7 was attacked and is now occupied by Omer forces. Their exact specifications are unknown, but you can expect some serious opposition on the way. The facility emits high density Kojima particles. These particles will degrade your primal armor and damage your machine. Once the plants are destroyed, we expect the situation to steadily worsen. You need to eradicate any Omer units that get in your way. Infiltrate down to the lowest level of the facility, destroy all the targets, and then make your escape at maximum speed. Briefing over. This is a dangerous mission, but that's why Taurus asked for you. We hope you can take care of it. Commence mission. Destroy the three Kojima energy plants at the lowest level of the facility. Approaching the facility's lowest level. Kojima particles are extremely dense in this area. Your primal armor can't be too here. Side your damage levels. Kojima energy plant destroyed. Two more to go. Destroyed. One more to go. Confirmed. All targets destroyed. Evacuate immediately. Detonation imminent. Barrier doors closing. Enemy reinforcements confirmed. Facility defenses are coming online. Doesn't matter, just blast through them. Prioritize your escape.
Here's your mission. The client is GA America. We want you to take out the Algebra Next team based at PAN51. The team consists of Red Rum, a rank 15 four-legged machine, and Starka, a rank 19 light model. The four-legged Red Rum is piloted by a very wily female Lynx. At this time of year, N51 is often cloaked in a thick layer of fog, assume limited visibility. Make sure you install sufficient enemy detection equipment before you embark. Obviously, the enemy will work as a team. We've been authorized to provide support units for your mission. Let me know what you need. That's it. This one is tough. Stay on high alert. We'll be waiting for your answer. Commence mission. Eliminate the pair of enemy nexts. This fog is thick. They've also deployed ECM. Smells like an ambush. Keep your guard up. Mary Gate reporting for duty. I hate this fog. This is just how Shamir likes it. Let's put on a show. I'll drive them into the open. What fine sheep you are! Coming straight to the wolf's den for slaughter. <laughs> Neither of you are getting out of here alive. So thank you, old man. See Confirm. Confirmed. Starka has been taken out. mission. Seize control of the Karpal's facility. Eradicate as many defensive installations as possible before Noblesse Oblige reaches the combat zone. That should make things go more smoothly.
detected. It's closing in fast. That's him. Obliterate Noblesse Oblige. Sorry to crash the party. Little hit and run bandits like you know no honor. I envy your simple life, void of responsibility. were successful, the energy reserves upon which the cradles relied were suddenly threatened. The Orca leader, a man known as Maximilian Thermidor, made an announcement to the world. The message was simple. League dogs, welcome to Earth. To the people who lived in the skies, it was nothing less than a declaration of war. The League was forced to abandon the tried and true strategies of the economic war. Suddenly, people realized that against these revolutionaries, their mighty castles were actually built out of sand. while taking out the main enemy force. You're Collard's Lynx? I've heard of you. So, Thermidor has approved you. I hope you live up to your reputation. I'll lead the attack with my assault cannon. Don't get in my way. It won't end well. Before the National Dismantlement War, corporations fought over control of the last frontier, outer space. 
In order to block each other's progress, they built lethal unmanned weapons called assault cells. As the fighting intensified, the planet's orbit became crowded with these assault cells. The path to space became completely blocked for mankind. Maximilian Thermidor made another proclamation. He said, The crimes committed by these companies are robbing humanity of its future. Eventually, they will destroy the entire planet. The National Dismantlement War and the Lynx War as well were waged to hide their crimes. Orca stands against them, fighting now to purge those sins. It is too late for compromises. Sacrifices must be made. The price we all must pay will be great. Atonement shall not be easy. The blame lies with all of us. The anti-satellite batteries have already taken out their elite forces. Hyteria is already halfway to obliteration. It should be easy enough now. We'll just pick off the most obvious targets first. When we're finished with those, they'll gladly return to the bargaining table. The old guard are quick to panic and that seems certain changes, especially those whose past successes have made them complacent. mission. Destroy the Arms Fort Answerer. They must be using a massive amount of energy to keep this thing afloat. Start your attack run now. Hit it wherever you can. Destroy the outer shell. It won't hold up too long. We can bring this thing back down to Earth. Massive amounts of Kojima energy emanating from the core. It's attacking with assault armor. Get out of there now. Good, it's working. Continue the attack run.
confirmed. The answerer has been destroyed. Mission complete. So, this is the beginning of the end. You think it'll be easy? Target the two next, Ryder Palash and Myblis. You've chosen your answer. Now see it through. Our guests have arrived, Wendy. Right on schedule. You don't hesitate to kill for humanity, do you? Then lay down your own life, like Thermidor before you. took control of Cranium. Without the energy needed to support them, the cradles fell to Earth. In the devastation and poisoned air of the planet's surface, infants coughed feebly in the arms of their despairing mothers, while the anti-satellite batteries continued their steady charge. When their power is finally unleashed, the web of assault cells over the planet will be destroyed, the sins of the corporations purged. Even as humanity is decimated, they will discover a new frontier, outer space. A new direction at last. It will be a time of growth, of ambition, and of war. 